Welcome to the Running Network Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. Hello, everyone. This is Gary Morgan with the Michigan Runner and Running Network News. Anyway, well, we're here at Drake Stadium out here in Des Moines, Iowa, for the ever-famous USA Track and Field Championships. They have the Junior Championships and the Open Championships. And for the Open Championships, it's selecting our World Championship team that's going to Moscow in August, so and which I'll be there reporting on. And we have one other little character we want to uh, join up with. The ever famous Drake Stadium Bulldog. They call him Spike. He's an original man. My little buddy here. So anyway, and he's guarding the stadium while the rest of us are in there watching the big time meet. I was in race with those guys, so you know. Um, I just, I just got back to my composure and, and tried to finish strong. And I, I realized in the middle of the race I was in like fifth or sixth place. And then, you know, I said just forget my hamstring. It just, if, if I hurt it, I'll just hurt it. And um, I came out with third place. Well, are you going to, you know, pushing yourself to that limit? Does that tell you that there's a lot more left? Yeah, it's, it tells me there's a whole lot more left. You know, um, I set out last week. To, to try to get my hamstring back together, um, it was fine until uh, the semifinal. So you know, just did a little exercise on it just to uh, just to get through this race. And I got through the race and got third. So I was just I'm amazed about that. I'm lost for words right now. How, how nerve-wracking was that waiting to see your name third spot? Um, I, I had a feeling that I got third because um, when I made the take, I looked to the side and it was I seen uh, Mike Rogers, but. You know, I feel like I was in front of him a little bit more, a little bit more. So, you know, but waiting for that, it was it was crazy because um, this is something I, I, I'm making steps towards. This. It's a thousandth of a second. Yeah, <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah. So, you know, um, I, I feel like I'm just blessed to make it. You know, um, I feel like um, I, I have a lot in front of me, so I'll be ready by the time I'm How much confidence does it give you to beat the number of guys you did beat? I mean, so um, it gave me a whole lot. It gave me a lot of confidence. Uh, you know, I just, I just want to make sure I, I keep my composure and keep my humbleness and um and, and the hunger for me to fight to, to try to be the best in United States. Peeking through the curtain, you were on the phone with someone smiling. I mean, I mean who was that phone call? I mean, what were the first words there? <laughs> uh, that was my mom. You know, um, she's she's been my my number one fan through the whole ride here, you know, through the two ACL injuries and stuff like that. So, you know, it's just, I, I feel like she's my angel, you know, my guardian angel, you know, she prayed for me and stuff like that. So I, I just love her and that'd be the first person I call every time. <laughs> so you mentioned two ACL injuries. I mean, the comeback, I mean, I mean, at what point did you kind of think of picking things, I mean, picking things up and getting here? Was that? Um, you know, it, it was a four year process, you know, um, my first year at TCU, um, it didn't it turn out as well. My first two years at TCU, it didn't turn out well. But I started catching on last year, and uh, I got better through the year all this year. So, you know, the, the goal was to just to win every race. Don't worry about time. Just try to win every race, and time will show. And uh, basically, this is my first, my, my second hundred I lost all year. And, um, and, that, and that was two pros that I lost this year. So. Uh, junior year 2008 and 2009. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So where do you go from here before before world? Um, um, I'm, I decided to run with the World University team, so you know uh, that'll be my my first opening up. Uh, probably run 100. More than likely, I'll run 100 to try to get the kinks out because um, I'm, I'm going to go into recovery mode after this after today. So, you know, um, and then after that, um, it all depends on what me I get into because it's, it's just not coming out. Uh, yeah. so. <laughs> oh, this is my senior. Okay. You mean, so you're going back? No, I'm, I'm going back, but I'm done. Uh, Competing. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah.